The president making clear he'd support a boycott against the tire manufacturer amid indications that it's old to politically correct new treatise on what's acceptable and not acceptable behavior and comments and language doesn't uh, fly with him. Uh, never mind, the company is insisting none of this was policy. These were just, uh, you know, talking points among some staff members and not all the way up to the top. The damage is done. The stock is getting hit. And Dave Maney is here. Uh, the boycott issue, the president's raising, Dave. What do you think? Well, look, Neil, I think he's got a completely legitimate beef with the company. But the fact that he has a legitimate beef, in my opinion, would have been a great opportunity to say, you know, our, uh, our opponents here use cancel culture to go after this. Uh, let me show you how we do it. I'm going to I'm going to challenge the company. I'm going to tell you that I disagree. I'm going to tell you that, you know, that I'm a I'm a supporter of Blue Lives Matter, whatever he wanted to say. But instead, you know, as is so often the case, he gets he takes an opportunity handed to him and manages to squander it, in effect, by engaging the cancel culture and saying, you know, we have to do the same thing. And it's like, God, no, you don't have to do the same thing. Like, that's what you should be against. But I'm wondering if it's part of a grander strategy on his part that repeats the theme, um, our views, law and order views, uh, the, the silent America, the old Spiro, you know, uh, Agnew line in 1968, that, that this is something he's tapping. There's something more about going after a company or, or citing, a, a, you know, a social media player for bias. There's, there's a grander picture here. How do you think it's sorting out? There is a grander picture, and again, I, I think he—I mean, I think he's onto something and onto something powerful. I—you you asked about the boycott. I thought the boycott was like you know you should have chosen a different tactic. Having said that, if you read this this tweet from Goodyear where they kind of said, "Oh, we didn't, we didn't say that, we didn't say that," it's a weasel-worded kind of dance around. <laughs> and in my opinion, you know, you have a lot of corporations that are playing kind of footsie. With, with the Black Lives Matter movement. And I, I absolutely think the president has a big opening in saying this is not just about racial equality. This is a political agenda. And they can't play footsie politically and then tell my supporters that they can't, they, that they can't express themselves. That's well put. I like it. I'm going to steal that line and not credit you. Um, Dave Maney, thank you very much, my friend. Very good seeing you continue. Good health, good head on their shoulders, just sees things beyond just the crazy politics of it.